So let's go ahead and get it started. Number one, eating low carb junk food, all right? There is no such thing as a keto brownie, all right? If you are going to, <laughs> there is such thing as a keto brownie, but my point is, is it's, it's kind of like, well, no, it's not even like that. I'm not even gonna go there because I could talk about that for an hour, but eating low carb junk food is not the point of keto, all right? The point is not to avoid carbs and eat a ton of calories and, and to make a brownie out of just fat and, I mean, what else do you make it out of? Just fat, right? Um, dietary fat is no safer from overeating than dietary carbohydrates or even dietary protein, although it's pretty damn hard to eat a, overeat steak, right? Nobody's binge eating steaks and chicken breasts and pork shoulders and things like that, right? It's just as easy to overeat fat than it is carbohydrates. Now, I'm not saying that, that everyone will do that, but I am saying that you can overeat fats, and we'll get into a little bit later uh, why you know ketosis and, and the ketogenic diet doesn't save you from getting fat. Uh, and we'll even talk about why that why some people feel fuller on, on a high fat diet, but we'll get to that in a minute. So eating low carb junk foods, keto brownies, keto cookies, keto pizza, like I'm, I'm somebody who, I've made a keto pizza. Now I'm not, you know, avoiding the, the idea that eating an entire pizza just because it's keto is gonna save me from overeating. But, you know, I do have a little bit of a gluten sensitivity, so I choose to use ingredients that don't cause that discomfort. But at no point during eating the pizza am I going, oh, this is really good for me. It's like, it's still, still a shit ton of calories, right? So don't pretend that, that keto eating can't push you over the edge and, and make you gain weight. And there's plenty of people that have gotten fat on keto, believe it or not. All right, so that's number one. Eating low carb junk food is not keto. 